Chicago, 1910. The temperance movement becomes more active. 15-year-old Rebecca Ross getting the most out of her education while her peers mess around. She and her younger brother Thomas are walking home from school covered in bruises from the abusive father, William. When the Ross children were young, their mother, Cindy, died in a tragic factory fire, leaving their father depressed and drinking, and the kids beat up and fending for themselves. One day, while the Ross children were walking home from school, Rebecca strikes up a conversation with one of the women participating and learns about the temperance movement. She finds out how she can help and becomes a part of the Women's Christian Temperance Unit Union. The next day, the WCTU, or Women's Christian Temperance Union, planned an exodus of all the men in the bars and saloons. When they had nearly finished, they presented Rebecca and her brother with money enough to, for them to both go to college. Rebecca enters the final bar and finds her father, who apologizes, and she accepts his apology.